Good morning, everybody. <laughs> I'm just waking up, and the gates just opened at 7, and uh, the track is hot at 9.30. So I'm going to go ahead, use the restroom, and get myself to the track already. I drove straight here, hung out just a little bit, saw some cars, got a hotel, went to sleep, and here I am. So, man, let's get into it, y'all. So uh, let me show you what I'm doing real quick. I am getting my quick advertisement in. Laid my Mac Motivate sticker down with my Go Sponsorship stickers. I love it because you can't see it from back here. Now you're going to notice it because the Mac Motivates is there. So can't commit any crimes in this car. <laughs> Mac Motivates there. Mac Motivates there. I'm honestly debating taking off this Never, Never Settle and putting it on top of it. Or putting it on top of it, I mean. So <sighs> I don't want to have too much going on. Uh, my son actually said to put Mac Motivates right here. It fits perfectly right there. Might be a cool idea. I may go ahead and do that. Five minutes later. So I got the back sticker on and then I put that one there. My son has suggested it. And I don't know guys, I don't, I'm not, I don't know about that. It's kind of bold, it's kind of just out there, but that's kind of the whole point. It's like if I'm driving and you can kind of see it there, you can see it there. Mainly the whole concept was most, most car shows you get the back end so you don't see that side. So I figured I'd put it right there so you can see it in the front. That decal there, and I instantly think, oh, let me get in here. And I instantly think of people who have that tattoo that's like right here. It's exactly what I think when I see that. Um, so I don't know, I may may pull that off. I'm gonna keep it on this weekend though, just, just in case people see the car and wanna follow, so yeah. All right, um, it's raining right now and it's cold, so I bet you track's not gonna start at 9.30 like they want. So let's just, let's see what happens and stay tuned.
guys. I haven't done the best job about keeping you updated. It's very windy, so I don't know if you're gonna be able to hear me or not. But uh, I've been trying to get trying to get footage and everything right now. So just hang tight. Bear with me. <laughs> Bucky's is hacked. <laughs> people bumping into people, dropping stuff. <laughs> it's crazy. Bucky's is wild, man. Then they have the beaver over here giving hugs and stuff. Hang on. Old Chuck E. Cheese looking ass. <laughs> Pretty wild, man. Pretty wild. Been getting good shots and stuff, but um, I was not waiting in that line for food. So I decided to come out here. To Bucky's again. I don't have one where I live, so I'm gonna go get some barbecue. Yeah, I'll keep y'all up to date here in a little bit. Though. Oh, Bucky's, I really recommend you. It's pretty, pretty good. They did go up on. This is like eight bucks, but I haven't ate it all today, so it is what it is. But uh, cool thing about me being media, I can kind of just go right in um, to the track whenever I want. I've got my own parking space. Um, I don't have to go pay for parking, so a little privileges to that. But I do have to wait in the line to get back in, which is gonna be kind of long, but um, that's what she said. Um, <laughs> that was delayed. But anyways, it's all right. I'm about to eat, get back out there, have some fun. Whew, I'm tired, y'all. I really, what the fuck? These things are creepy, hang on. I wonder where they come from, because they make the craziest sounds. See, you heard that? Sounds like he's going. Sounds like he's kissing. That's what it sounds like. 
Yeah, let me see if I can get a bunch of little gang of them over here. They'd be hiding everywhere. Little cows. Bunch of cows. Look at all them chickens. Cow and chicken. <laughs> look, look, look. They crazy, bro. Look, look at this dude. It'd be a shame if I you. <laughs>